We believe the Harvest Keeper Vacuum Sealer is one of the very best available. It's a commercial grade unit designed to deliver years of use. This short introductory video will share a couple of very basic functions and get you started using your Harvest Keeper Vacuum Sealer. We have other videos available and encourage you to watch all of them to get the most out of your Harvest Keeper Vacuum Sealer. Let's get started by placing your vacuum sealer on a clean and stable surface area and plug your machine into an appropriate power source. To turn on your vacuum sealer, simply flip the switch on the side of the unit to the on position. The digital display, the fan, and light will activate and go through its startup cycle. Once complete, your machine is now ready to use. This takes just a few seconds. Next, let's try adjusting the Harvest Keeper vacuum sealer settings and get familiar with these adjustments. Setting the seal time. We'll start by setting the seal time, which for most bags generally takes about three seconds. For standard three mil sealing bags, we recommend between a two and a half to three second seal. Should you experience the seal is insufficient, you can always adjust the seal time by pressing the function button until seal time is selected and adjust to the desired seal time by using the plus or minus button below the digital display. These will adjust the seal time in half second increments. The factory installed setting is 3 seconds, so if you need more or less sealing time, you'll need to reset the sealing time. Choosing the degree of vacuum. Next is adjusting the degree of vacuum that best suits whatever you're trying to vacuum seal. Here you'll press the vacuum degree button to choose either high, medium, low, or adjust. If adjust is selected, you can adjust up or down by using the plus or minus button below the digital display. It's important to note. The higher the degree, the more vacuum you will achieve. Use high settings for harder items such as bone-in meats and lower vacuum for more firm to delicate items. Sealing. Now that the settings are in place, it's time to seal. Cut the bag to the desired size, making sure you leave at least two inches of bag space above the item to ensure a proper seal. Insert the bag into the vacuum chamber space. It's important the bag is across the sealing gasket. Press the quick start button located near the vacuum chamber or the start button on the control panel to begin. The machine will close automatically and begin its cycle. The numbers shown on the digital screen are the degree of vacuum being applied. For example, low on the digital display is 23. The vacuum sealer will count up until this target number 23 is achieved. Once hit, the machine will automatically go into sealing mode. The digital display will count down based on default or customized sealing time settings. When sealing is complete, the machine will automatically open and beep. Remove bag and inspect vacuum and seal. At any point, if you see an issue during the vacuum sealing process, you can press the cancel button to stop the process. Pulse function. To use the pulse function, follow the same steps as before regarding the seal time, bag preparation, and insertion of the bag into the machine. To initiate the pulse function cycle, press pulse once. This will close the machine's chamber and the letter P will appear in the digital display, letting you know that pulse functionality is ready for use. Press the pulse button to apply vacuum to the bag. Vacuum will be applied for as long as you press the button. Once you have achieved the desired degree of vacuum, press the seal button and the machine will automatically begin its sealing cycle. Using the Harvest Keeper vacuum sealer is easy and fast. Better yet, you'll find that unlike other popular vacuum sealers, this one is truly a heavy duty unit that's built to last. We appreciate you purchasing the Harvest Keeper vacuum sealer and invite you to watch our other videos on how to get the most from your Harvest Keeper vacuum sealer.